Hey everyone, good morning. How is everybody today? Uh, how many of you out there are finding yourselves more and more in that mindset of just trying to work with what you have? Uh, I know I am, but I'm already one of those people that finds uh, fun in that idea, that challenge of working with what we have. But I have noticed that more and more people are trying to be more resourceful uh, and we're all trying to be more thoughtful with the number of trips we're making to the store and all of that. Uh, so I love love it when there's one item in our life that we can use in so many different ways. So this morning I'm going to remind you of one of those items we're going to celebrate in all of its different uses and we're talking about olive oil uh, and I'm talking about any of the olive oils, extra virgin, light, uh, any of them are suitable for all of these different applications. You could even experiment with some other oils that you have, maybe grapeseed um, or an avocado uh, or even a coconut oil in some of these applications. But uh, you can use olive oil way beyond uh, just cooking here in the kitchen and salad dressings. It also makes for a really um, an excellent makeup remover. I use it all the time. I'll just gently um, rub some all over my face and then I will wipe it away with, I have some of these dark cloths on hand, but it really does a beautiful job of removing eye makeup and all of it. Uh, and then normally I'll get a big thing of olive oil and then I'll split it out. I'll have a container of it in the bathroom um, because not only for makeup remover, but also it's really nice to use when you're coming out of the shower or the bath and you can add some essentials, essential oils to it to give it a really nice uh, fragrance. Uh, if you're wanting to give yourself a hot oil hair treatment, you can use it for that. Uh, if you're in a pinch for lip balm, which we all seem to find ourselves, I can't, you can, we have 20 of them, I can't find any of them, but you can find some olive oil, uh, that will uh, work in a pinch as well. Uh, it also serves as a really nice adhesive remover. If you have kids that are putting stickers uh, everywhere, stickers were in places you don't want stickers, or sometimes when you uh, purchase something, the adhesive from the price tag, uh, any of that kind of residue, olive oil will do a good job of helping to lift that away. I'll let it sit on the residue. Sometimes I'll even add some sweet orange uh, essential oil to it uh, and that'll do a nice job of lifting that away. You can wipe uh, the residue off. So adhesive remover, you can add that to the list. Uh, it also serves as um, a great uh, polish or a way to uh, richen up your uh, butcher block, your cutting boards, any of your wooden serving pieces and for that what I'll do is I'll take the olive oil one part olive oil I mix it with uh, one part distilled vinegar the white vinegar and then I'll add some lemon juice into that uh, mix it all up in a jar and then just wipe down all of your cutting boards um, any of your wooden serving pieces I'll let that soak in you can come back over it with a couple of applications but it's got the cleaning property with the vinegar and the lemon and then that oil will add that moisture back into uh, some of your wooden pieces. And then the latest thing that I just recently uh, discovered, somebody shared with me uh, on how to use olive oil that really does work beautifully is to take it straight up uh, and put it on a soft cloth and then wipe down all of your stainless steel appliances. Uh, and it does a wonderful job of adding this really nice shine to it. And it doesn't leave an oily residue or anything like that. So just just put some on a soft cloth, wipe down all of your stainless steel appliances. See for yourself, it adds a beautiful shine to it. But uh, I just love the fact that we can have, you know, one item, so many different uses. It really does simplify life. It simplifies shopping. Uh, it, you know, we don't have to have as many products uh, in our life. And then, you know, also down the road, it may even save us some money. And who doesn't love that? So olive oil, uh, get it out of the kitchen and try Try it in some other ways.